Right, so we've just beat Sengen Elena um, in hard mode in chapter 13. So I'm just going to show you the build that I used for this one. So obviously you used Aerith, Yuffie, and Red 13. So Aerith's using the Plimrose Rod, Cetron Armlet, and the Enhanced Expeditionary Medal. Now for the magic, it's all based around lightning. So it's lightning with the five um, blue materials. So magic, MP Absorb, HP Absorb, Swift Cast, and Magnify. And then we've got Magic Up, First Strike, Limit Siphon, and ATB Boost. And there's someone we're using as Phoenix. And then for the weapon abilities, we've got Enduring Ward, Ward Shift Mastery, Enhanced Tempest, and Max HP plus 200. Moving over to Yuffie, we're running the Crescent Sickle, the Enhanced Egrazil Armlet, and the Speed Demon Keychain. And for the magic, we've got Time Materia. ATB boost and then a bunch of purples just to pack out the stats. So we've got two spirits up, two vitality ups, two steadfast block, two luck, and a speed up and the first strike material. Make sure we equip these two and also the ATB boost. Moving over to red, we're using the amethyst collar, the Cetra Embrace, and a limit booster. And his material is ice based with HP up, magic focus, magnify, and MP absorption. Also went with enemy skill and limit support materia. We actually forgot to add a few more purples to pack that out. Feel free to add HP up and things like that if you'd need to. And also we've got the Gilgamesh materia. Again, for the weapon abilities, attack power plus 20 and limit bake damage plus 10%. We don't even use them. In all fairness, you could probably stick ATB charge rate up just so they're getting the ATBs quicker. And potentially the other attack plus 20. Anyway, let's get into the battle. Right, so straight away you want to cast ATP boost with Aerith, and then you want to cast the ATP ward on Yuffie and start spamming um, Brumal Form. Apologies for the voice, as you probably can tell, it's a little bit different. I've been under the weather, but nothing stops me from bringing you these guides. Um, yes, yeah, so you want to start spamming Brumal Form with Yuffie, and then you want Yuffie to cast Haste on herself just to help to speed up the process with Brumal Form. You're then going to use Thundarga on Eleanor, and we're going to use Blizzarga on Seng. We're just going to keep on basically doing that for the rest of this fight. As you can see, Eleanor's staggered now. We're going to switch to Yuffie, keep on spamming Brumal Form, and every time Aerith and Red 13 get two ATBs, we're just going to cast, obviously, level three magic on them, and it's going to push them into the second stage, as you can see. Elena, with me. Okay. Now, we're in a good position here. We can see you've nearly got the ATB boost bars for Aerith and Red 13 going into the second phase, which is going to be crucial. Because we want to make sure we knock the Turks out of their synergy ability. So as you can see, tag team. We want to get them out of that as quickly as possible. But at this point with Aerith, we're going to use Limit Siphon on Yuffie. As you can see, it fails first time for some reason. And I notice it. So we just then go back to Aerith, use Limit Siphon on Yuffie. And then we're going to cast Planet Protection with Aerith. So we kind of just uh, mitigate all that damage and make this battle a lot easier and a lot more efficient and then we're just going to go back to Yuffie spamming Brumal Form in the ATB ward and continue using Thundarga and Blizzarga until they're both defeated it's a proper cheese this way but also you know it does get you through those tougher battles people just want to get hard mode completed so why not and as you can see we just use Blizzarga and Thundarga. Eleanor's going to be defeated any second now after being staggered for the second time. And then we're just going to focus on Rude. Um, as you can see there, Eleanor has been taken out with that final Blizzarga. And then we're just going to do the same to Seng, spamming the abilities as quickly as possible. As you can see, we just got Seng staggered, and then we're going to do a couple of more level 3 attacks, and the fight is over. Anyway, if you did like today's Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth video, and it did help you out, hit the like button for me, subscribe if you're new, and yeah, that's the video.
You're not getting past me. I'm a Turk. God damn it! 